Power Rangers Cosmic Fury was epic, and even though we are not getting a season of Power Rangers next year, Cosmic Fury set it up so we could get a season later down the line. Let's talk about it, break it down, hit that intro, Rangers. You are watching the fan club. You're watching the fan club. And you're watching the fan club. Do you know what time it is? And you know what time it is. It's time for the fan club. Let's go. Hey! You know things ain't always sweet when you out here in these streets. But my morph when it morph, I made a fake. Hey, what's going on, everyone? Welcome to the fan club. It is your boy, Braz Dan Brosnan, in the building. Now, it's been a couple days since I made a video. It has been a crazy couple weeks for me. So, last Friday, Cosmic Fury comes out, and I have to DJ three events in a row. Then this weekend, I had three events in a row. But wedding season is coming to a close. By the end of November, I am pretty dead, so I will be making a lot more videos. Today, we wanted to talk about the potential of a spinoff or a continuation of Cosmic Fury. The way that they ended it was pretty dope. We saw that our boy Zato becomes a Morphin Master, and I loved it. We also find out that Zordon's essence is still out there. Somehow, Ion tapped into the Morphin Grid and talked to Zordon, even though he looked like Zato. It was Zordon in there, and it was so cool. Those small things open it up so later down the line, we could have a new season of Power Rangers. They didn't really close everything down. Yes, they closed it down for now, but Lord Zed is still alive. Lord Zed is on that nightmare planet. What if he gets free? What if he actually becomes good and later down the line, he's an ally to the Rangers? There are a lot of questions and things that could happen with Power Rangers in the future. And I love that they didn't just close the box 100%. They left it open in a few ways. And this is the second Power Rangers show this year where Billy at the end is thinking about Zordon. He did it in Once and Always, and he did it in Cosmic Fury. There almost has to be a season or a special that connects it all together. And I just love seeing the old Mighty Morphin cast come back. Once and Always was awesome. I really enjoyed it. Cosmic Fury knocked my socks off. I absolutely loved this season. I loved the Rangers. I loved Amelia as the Red Ranger. Zato as the Zenith Ranger was fire. For all the fans that were thinking that he was going to get demoted, no. He was just as much part of the story as everybody else, but he had his own part of the story. And he's arguably the greatest Ranger of all time now, or most powerful because he's not only a great leader, but he sacrificed himself many times to save the team. And he's a Morphin Master. Oh my gosh. Speaking of the Morphin Masters, that is the next show that I would love to potentially get. A show all about how the Morphin Masters came to be. Maybe a story about them right now. Like... There is so much that you can do with these Power Rangers stories and Cosmic Fury left the door wide open. We know in 2024, well, most likely there's like a 95% chance that we're not getting anything. Nothing has been announced. There's no toys. There's no show. There's pretty much nothing as of right now. And I mean, we're getting closer to the end of the year, but we did hear some information about the reboot that they will be filming and shooting it next year, which is freaking awesome. It is about time. But where does that leave this Power Rangers franchise as we know it? I think we will be taking a break, but I don't think the Power Rangers that we know are completely done forever. There might be a couple years off, but don't be surprised if they come back and pick up on this story. 
I am 100% down. And tell you the truth, I would love to see the Dino Fury cast again. I thought it was so cool. And hey, if they wanted to make uh, 10 new episodes and call it Cosmic Fury Part 2, I would be down. I think there's a lot of stuff that you could still talk about. I would love to see more of Tarek. I'd love to see more of Santara. I'd love to see more of Amelia as the leader. I would love to see more pretty much all of the Rangers. And I think it would be awesome if they had some type of show about Zato being the Morphin Master. Freaking sweet, man. But what are your guys' thoughts? What did you think of Cosmic Fury? Let me know in the comments. Speaking of the comments, let's see what the fans are saying. Tan Man said, I love the season. Ion talking to Zordon and Billy freaking out, realizing he is still out there. If Zordon is still out there, I hope they build on this with the reboot. I know it's not a direct continuation, but I hear the reboot does have some elements from Power Rangers. I agree. I hope they build that out in some way, even if they don't with the reboot. Maybe in a couple years, they try to bring back this format of Power Rangers. I don't know. James said, I love the ending of Cosmic Fury. Zato becomes a Morphin Master. I was getting emotional when he became one. It was great. Honestly, watching him go from the red Dino Fury Ranger to that white Ranger to the Zenith to a Morphin Master, it was quite the journey for the homie Zato. Airman said, I'm watching Cosmic Fury now and I'm enjoying the series. Billy returning felt like he still got it. He does still got it. Jay said so many emotions during this season. I've been watching since I was 10. When the series premiered, I'm now 40. I've stuck around. I was in my emotions. It felt like a satisfying ending to the series. I loved it. I was satisfied, but also excited to see what was going to happen. Nikki said so much for a series finale because they left the show open ending, like mentioning future potential of Zordon's resurrection. I can't help but have the feeling that the studio seems to have other future plans that they are not telling. I agree. I'm with you. I really hope that there is something behind closed doors that is happening. Almost Full Moon says, Your channel rocks. Keep up the great content. Power Rangers forever. Hyped F said, I enjoyed Cosmic Fury. I watched all of it from 9 p.m. to 2 a.m., it took me until after midnight to complete the 10 episodes. They need to have more continuities active at once. A main universe, a King Oger adaption, a reboot universe, and a Jew Oger adaption universe. Oh, man. That would be awesome. Let's hope they can start with two. Let's get a couple things going and build that up. Gold Miss Prime said, This is absolutely, without a doubt, the best Power Rangers season in the last 10 years, and maybe more than that. Yeah, the last season I can remember that was at least as good as this was RPM, and what, that was 2009? Jeez, 14 years ago? Holy crap. But what are your guys' thoughts? Let me know in the comments. Shout out all of the fans out there that take the time out of their day to watch this content. You are the real MVPs and the reason why we can continue to make videos like this one. Thank you guys so much and we will see you next time. Peace. I want to give a special shout out to the Gold Ranger members, Anime King Nick, Chaos Draco, The Arctic Operator, Gig Wyron, Tim Rage, Roderick Hare, Miguel Ortiz, Let's Talk Sports, Papleon Oger, Roderick Ham, Jason Morazis, Willie Maloney, Louis Cairns, Salima Ramirez, Danny Nascimento, Skurd, Stephen Heffelman, Thomas Franco, Savage Sal, Tim Brown, Sean Schiffer, The Cosmic Nerd 24, Bruce Walters, and Austin White. Thank you guys so much for your support, and if you want a video shout out like this one, sign up to be a Gold Ranger member today.
thanks for watching this video. If you like this content, you know what to do. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. You can also become a member. Please join the fan club support team right now. We have a Blue Ranger power up and a Gold Ranger power up. This is an awesome way to talk with the fans. Join a fan club official chat group. You can also be featured in our videos. At the end of the videos, I will shout you out. That's if you get the Gold Ranger Power Up membership. Go check it out. Go support the fan club. We love you guys, and thanks for watching. Peace. Hi. Hi. We're Bulk and Skull. We, we have are been requested, requested by, by the, the fan club to say something funny. Ha, ha, ha.